So for today's video I have got my room tour for 2017 and I'm honestly so excited to be filming this video because you guys have requested it so much and I'm finally getting around to filming it for you guys. My room is finally like all together and I'm so so happy with how it looks now because it was definitely a room transformation from what it did look like um, and I'm just so happy with everything that's in it. I hope you guys enjoy this video, hopefully it gives you some inspiration for your own room and gives you some ideas of what you could have in your room. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up and if you're new to my channel and you've never seen my face before make sure to subscribe, I'd really really appreciate that and we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers which is crazy like I think that's all I have to say I'm sure you guys just want me to stop talking now because you just want to see my room and I do talk a lot in this video just warning you guys um but yeah without further ado let's get started in my room tour so first one, I'm going to give you guys a quick overview of my room just so you can see what it looks like and like the sizing of it First of all, I'm going to start off with this side of my room because this is like the closest and this is what you kind of see first when you walk in. Um, so this is just what my desk area looks like slash like vanity area, whichever one you want to call it. Um, but first of all, I'm going to start off with these shelves. Both of these shelves are from Ikea and I have a range of different like items on each one so I'm just going to go through what's on each shelf. First of all, I've got my light box. Um, my mum actually got that from, I think it was a new look. Those are different letters that you can pop in the light box. So, as it is summer. And then I've just got a candle burning, no surprise. Um, I've always got candles burning in my room because it just gives off a really nice scent to your room. And this is a Yankee candle one and it's in the scent. I think it's clean cotton. Then we've got my pineapple money jar. I actually don't use it for money, I just think it looks nice as like a decoration. A lot of people wanted to know where this is from and it's from New Look and it's like a copper sort of colour which I absolutely love. So this is the second shelf. Um, so first of all we've got some flowers. These flowers are from New Look and they're obviously fake ones. Um, I've then got some glasses. Um, these aren't real glasses, they're just for like style I guess. Um, and these are from Nobody's Child and they just look kind of cool just to have them show. And then I've got this candle holder from Urban Outfitters again with another Yankee candle um, inside of it. I've had this um, candle holder for at least a good two years now and I absolutely love it like obsessed with it because you know it's copper and I absolutely love the sort of geometric sort of style, I think that's what it's called. My makeup holder, you've probably seen this in my makeup collections if you've been subscribed for a little while now. This is um, from Ikea, these are super popular, I think they're called the Skura Pots, I think that's how you say it. And I've just basically got all my makeup brushes in there, they're just really easy to get to. And I've put my makeup brush pot in like the lower shelf so it's just like easier to get to when I'm doing my makeup. So above the lowest shelf, as you go up, I've just got a quote here just says work out, study, prosper, be your best self. Um, I actually got this off of La La Lab. You can print like quotes and any like photos. I really, really liked it and it's like really simple and I don't know, just wanted something to fill up that space on my walls. As you go round, I've got this, um, I don't really know what to call this, but it's from Ikea and um, it's like nailed into the wall. Um, and this is just really good if you just want to put anything on show. Well, we bought these two separately, so this was just really good to put anything on show. So I've got my Instax Mini 8 Polaroid camera, super cute, really Tumblr. I've had that for like three years and it's just so cute and really handy if you want to take any cute photos. I've then got some washi tape, oh it's got washi tape on me. Um, I've got a little um, handy little mirror. I've got Chloe Couture's um, like merch, she brought out like t-shirts and like badges and they're really really cool and I was kindly sent them so and then I've also got my Beautycon London uh, it's like a map and I really wanted to keep this just so I could be reminded of it because Beautycon London was honestly the best day ever and then as you go down I've just got this like Polaroid style photo that my mum took of me and I just thought it was kind of like a nice little photo um, and it's just stuck up with some 
washi tape which is that one there like I said I bought this separately for like this board um, and it's really good just to keep all my pens in there so I've got a few like Muji pens in lots of different colors um, I've got some scissors a ruler I've just got some revision cards in some different colors pencils a white pen you got this huge sunflower which is obviously fake and my mum got it for me um, I think it's from Ikea I'm not really sure just add some like color in my room makes it really summery now I'm gonna go into my desk area which is probably like again one of like my favorite parts of my room because I'm usually always sat here so I like to make it very simple but have all like my favorite bits and bobs on my desk first of all I've got my handy little glass pot full of my cotton pads um, always have to have a lot of these because I get through them so quickly because I use them to remove my makeup with. This glass little pot and I basically just keep any jewellery, hairbands, earrings, uh, my watch. Um, and then we've got my little makeup mirror I like to call it because I usually do my makeup in this mirror and it's also got like a better like magnified side on the other side and you can just see my bed in the background and then I've just popped my cap for my camera um, and then there's me. Hey. Um, and then as you go next to my mirror, I've got this acrylic makeup storage holder. I think that's what it's called. Um, you can get loads of different designs of Amazon. I got this one off of Amazon and it fits everything in really, really well. So over here, I've got like my nicer high-end lipsticks. Uh, not that I wear them on a daily basis. It's just nice to have on show because they look nice. And it's also like a good reminder for me to actually wear them. In this section, it's basically any new products that I need to try out or any products that I like to use on a daily basis. Uh, I've got like my favourite highlighter at the back there which is the Emua Indrisha Skin Highlighter. Um, my favourite nail varnish because it's like a really pretty pinky nude colour. Yeah it fits everything in really really well and I really like how it looks all nice and neat and tidy. I've got my um, everyday perfume at the moment. This is by Zara and it's in the scent fruity. It's like a perfect summer perfume and I wear that pretty much every single day. I've got some fairy lights just going along my desk. It just makes it look really pretty and at night time it also like adds to my room, makes it a little bit more cozier. Um, and then over in the corner here I've just got this plant pot. To show you in better light, it just looks like this. It's from Ikea. What a surprise, a lot of my plants are from Ikea. And here I've just got my computer. I've always got this at my desk because I use it all the time either to watch YouTube, um, edit my videos, um, homework, anything. This isn't like too interesting but this is like almost my school sort of side so I've got a notepad with like so much lined paper that's usually good just to write notes down when I'm revising. I've got a lot of revision cards as you can see I've been doing uh, science revision as I've got my science mocks soon um, and then I've just got some uh, post-it notes always really handy to have them underneath this notepad I've got my GCSE AQA science books for revision for physics biology and chemistry a lot of fun stuff I'm sure you guys really wanted to know that I'm wondering what these are called they're called Alex 5 drawers they're really good like storage units for I already had one of these where I stored all my makeup in but I just I didn't have it as like a style of a desk because I've seen a lot of people have two of these so I bought another one which is over there as you can see so I've got the two Alex drawers on either side and then the desktop on top to create like a vanity desk area. So it looks really, really good and it's just a great sort of style of a desk because you've got all your storage next to you so it's like really easy to get to. This side I've got my more exciting sort of beauty uh, storage unit. So the first drawer is my palette drawer. Um, I'm not going to go into detail with every product because I've already done a separate video on that for my makeup collection and nothing's really changed. Um, yeah, that's my palette drawer. Um, second drawer is like my overall makeup drawer, like base makeup, lipsticks, lip glosses, highlighters, bronzers, and uh, mascaras. Third drawer is my skincare drawer. Um, so I've got cleansers, moisturizers, my Vanity Planet cleansing brush. Love that. And sent some lovely uh, beauty subscriptions recently, so I'm excited to try out some of these like new products. At the back, um, I've got some. These are almost like travel makeup bags. Uh, I've got a lot of these because I get sent a Love Me Beauty subscription every month, so they always come in these. So I'm slowly collecting these. Um, but as you can see at the back, I've got a lot of Soap and Glory products. These are like previous Christmas products because I still need to get through them, but it's like body lotions, body scrub. My fourth drawer is my hair drawer. 
So I've got hair grips, hairspray, um, my healthy hair uh, styling treatment, which I use on wet hair when I'm like styling it, uh, heat protecting spray when I'm like straightening or curling my hair, my Persian Reed um, fragrance hair shine spray. And I've just got my Tangle Teaser, which is like my day to day hair brush, my OGX uh, hydration oil, love that. And then I've just got this little copper pot, which has a load of different earrings in it's a bit messy and a bit modelled up but just got a load of different earrings in there in the very last bottom drawer it's a bit of a mixture to be honest just stuff where i just generally don't know where to put a few different yankee candles which i still need to use i'm very excited to burn them so i've got a spare ikea vanilla um candle um i've then got a lash product this is a soap i've just got my tan and i use the filth tan if anyone's wondering because a lot of people wanted to know what tan i use and i use this one and it's in the shade light and it's really really nice really natural exfoliating uh gloves uh, really good to like remove tan or if you just want to exfoliate your body the zoella bar fizzes um as you can see i haven't really used a lot i really need to start using them up i've actually showed you guys my chair and i absolutely love this chair like I don't know, I just love what it looks like. What a surprise, it's from Ikea. Um, it's really, really comfy. Um, usually I do have like a pillow here or like a blanket, but I took it off like the video just so you could like see the chair a lot better. But I'm not gonna go into too much detail about this one because this is basically where I store a lot of my schoolwork, like my school books. I store like homework in here, camera bits and bobs, like leads and old like books and just a load of random things to be honest. And I have my ring light. Um, this was a bit of like an awkward thing because I didn't know where to put it in my room because where it is quite big and that's the smallest that it goes. Um, this was like the only place where I could just pop it in the corner there, but it fits really well and this is just what I use to film my videos. As you go around, you see me. This is my full length mirror. So it's just really good to check my outfit of the days, um, just to see what I'm wearing. It's also good for like taking outfit photos for Instagram. Um, I just think it's always good to have like a full length mirror just to see your outfits. Um, and this uh, mirror is from Ikea. Just above my mirror, I've just got my light up dream sign and this is from New Look. And then as you come round, I'll come onto that section in a minute. As you come down, you've got my bedside table. First of all, I've got my book that I'm currently reading at the moment and it's called Girl Boss. I absolutely love this book. Um, I've heard so many good things about it, so I really wanted to start reading it. And then I've just got my little plant. This is from New Look. I get a lot of my plants either from Ikea or New Look. Um, New Look do some really nice homeware stuff and I loved the design of the pot. So this definitely had to be my room tour and it's my water bottle from Victoria's Secret. Um, I always have this in my room and then next to that I've got my favourite like literally my favourite lamp I've ever had it's this really lovely like reading lamp and it's copper I just love the whole design of it and you can like move it so you can have it in like different angles depending on where you want it which is really really handy usually I've just got my phone on my bedside table just just sits there to be honest um but yeah that's what's on my bedside table i've had this bedside table for literally i want to say three years now so it's quite old and it's from ikea um it's getting a little bit dirty because where i do paint my nails on here sometimes the nail varnish goes on here so if there's any marks i'm really sorry about that i do clean it don't worry and then just above my bedside table, I've just got a few different quotes, which I ordered off of La La Lab. If you don't know what La La Lab is, it's basically a app where you can order off pictures and all different types of styles, like Polaroid styles or just simple plain styles like this. It's really good because it just fills up this part of my room, like this wall, because it did look a little bit blank and I really wanted to fill them up with like quotes. As you come down from the quotes my wall, you come to my bed area. And obviously this is like my main part of my room because it takes up the most room. Um, but here's just a little overview of my bed. It's from Ikea and it's classed as a day bed because it can go into a single bed like this, which is what I always have it like, but it can also pull out into a double bed, which is so good if like friends are coming around for like, if any of you are wondering where I keep any of my clothes, I keep them in these three drawers here. And any of you guess where my blanket's from? It's from Ikea. Um, this blanket is so stretchy. It can like spread out so far. Uh, but the reason why I got this one is because I love the design of it. Like it's got this sort of like frilly 
sort of look to it. Um, it's really, really soft and it makes your bed look really comfy and cosy. Then I've just got some white bedding sheets from, you can get these from anywhere to be honest, I'm not actually sure where these are from. And then we come to my pillows. This one is from Ikea, this one is from New Look, this one is also from Ikea. I think this one's from Ikea and this one which is so fluffy, so soft and it's just so comfy, that is from New Look. So basically all the pillows here are either from Ikea or New Look. As you go around, it comes to my most favourite part of my room, like, and this is my clothing rail, and I got this from Ikea, and what I've done is i wrapped fairy lights all around, just to make it look really pretty, and again, during the evening time, it looks super, super nice. These clothes aren't necessarily, like, the clothes I wear on, like, an everyday basis, these are, like, ones that I either really, really like, I wear a lot, or I just want them to be on show because they look really nice, so... I've got quite a lot of my nice off-the-shoulder tops, some really pretty shorts, which I love. Again, off-the-shoulder tops, and um, I like to arrange it for the different seasons, so obviously where it's summer now, I've got a lot of my summer clothes out, as well as a few jumpers, because, you know, I, I do live in jumpers. On each corner, um, on this one, I've got my kind of bags that I've been using recently, so this is my little rucksack, or backpack, whichever one you want to call it beach bag because we're at summer I've been taking this out to the beach a lot or just going out really and then on this side I've got my cap and this is from H&M and it's the sportswear um, range I've been wearing this a lot because it's actually been surprisingly so hot in England I'm wondering where these fairy lights are from they're from Ikea I feel like I've said Ikea so much in this video this video is not sponsored by Ikea whatsoever this is again also from Ikea and it's made for the clothes row, it's really good for storage if you want to, again, put clothes in here. Bottom, you've got your shoe sort of rack. So these are like my day-to-day -day shoes. Well, these aren't really, but these are kind of like going out sort of heels. Um, and then I've got my really clean Superstar Adidas trainers. Jokes, they're not actually that clean at all. Like, look at that. I wear them way too much. And these are my PE trainers for school. But I like to wear them out sometimes because they're super comfy. I've then got my... Topshop sliders. I wear these a lot, especially recently where it's been so warm. They're really, really cute and I love the design of them. Um, obviously it's not real snakeskin, <laughs> just to put that out there. Uh, I don't know if you can see at the back there if you're wondering what that is. It's my photography book because if you don't already know, I take photography for GCSE. It takes up a lot of space and it's so heavy. Um, but yeah, that's just at the back there. Going along for my shoe rack, on the floor, I forgot to mention, I've actually got a faux fur rug, so it's not actual real fur, um, it is fake, um, but it's so soft. Um, as you go around from my clothes row, you've just got my door, I've just got all like, my dressing gowns at the back, nothing too interesting. And then down there, I've just got my bin. Not sure where that's from, I've had it for quite a while. But so that is the end of my room tour for 2017. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully it gave you some inspiration for your own room. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really, really appreciate that. And have a lovely day wherever you are in the world. And hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video.